with that. So um, I'm gonna do a, a little something new that I've never done before. Um, we have these three signs here, which is Gemini, Capricorn, yeah, Capricorn, right? Yeah, and Aquarius. So um, these three signs, I'm gonna choose, um, well, not choose, I'm gonna see what flies out of the tarot deck. We're just gonna get an energy, what's the energy gonna be like for me, okay? So, we're gonna go with Gemini. Let's see, what's the energy in May for Gemini? What's the energy for Gemini? Mm -mm, you are still on the floor. Gemini. All right. Gemini, you always fell on the floor, but it fell reverse. So we got the Nine of Cups reverse. Mm, so this is a love situation nine of cups that went astray that's what i feel like you're not satisfied about something you feeling complacent this is a, a love situation that you are not happy in that's what i'm getting something that you're not happy with at this moment it's not going as you would have liked it to go. That's the May energy. Unfortunately, I don't I don't like to see that for you guys. Capricorn, let's see what the May energy is. Okay. Capricorn May energy is the Ten of Swords. All right. So y'all gonna be in this. It's like a lot of stress, a lot of pain about something. A lot of stress and pain. A lot of hurt. You guys pick yourself up out this energy though. Because that's not a good energy to be in. You just feel like the weight of the world is on your shoulders, you know? So, if you all Capricorns are going through a, a tough situation that may just know, just stay grounded, stay in your meditation, and just find your peace. Go within, okay? My aquas. Oops, got one. Let's see. The chariot moving forward, awkward. Um, so you're gonna be moving forward um on a situation. You could be going on some trips, you could be getting a new car. That's exciting. Um definitely going on trips and just moving in a new direction. So yeah, pretty good, pretty good guys. All right.